So because it's so hot, I'm actually going to make a decision here to go ahead and wean. Um, we're going to go ahead and pull some babies off of both of these moms. This one here is actually a week behind the other. Um, but all the babies are eating. Uh, they're eating on, on grain and stuff like that and, and chewing on little bits of hay and things. So um, they're perfectly fine. They're, they're all healthy. Um, it, it's so hot. I'm just going to I'm just going to take that added stress away from the mothers right now and um, They're not going to miss their babies at, at, at this point right now So we're going to go ahead and uh, I think we're going to get all the babies into one stall and then uh, We're going to leave the mothers where they are for right now um, just to kind of uh, Cool down a little bit make sure they're not going to stress out just to double check, but I, I think we're good uh, It's so hot. I don't think you really want much to do with them. So Let's go ahead and get some doors shut. We're going to get some pigs moved around and go from there. So we just put them all together. Got this straw in here for them. We're going to go ahead and get some feed in here uh, just to give them some more time to chill out, maybe get something to eat. This is uh, mom over here. That's going to give her a break. And this is Laura over here, and she's going to get a break too, and uh, we're going to go ahead and wean them off. Hey guys, Mike back here with you today. Uh, getting ready to go ahead and build an alleyway here to try to get uh, pigs from one pasture over here to the new Fairwind barn. And um, it is, uh, I, I don't know, it's got to be 90 some degrees again today. Uh, it's hot around here and um, we're going to go ahead and get some posts put in the ground we're going to build just a short alleyway and again it's just kind of to move uh move our pregnant sows from the one pasture that's over here uh through the alleyway and then into the farrowing barn so um let me just take a, a minute here to show you guys so what we're doing here i've, I've got some things laid out um we're going to kind of put a fence gate here at the at the end um, and, and it'll shut to the building there to, to kind of close it off it I think I'm going to build a 36 inch alleyway here um, it's enough to where uh, we can we can work with it and, and kind of bring the uh, the boards to move pegs in and stuff like that so um, could probably do it tighter you know maybe to, to keep them from turning around but um, I think 36 inches is good and, and we're just going to hold with that so um, we're going to go ahead and build an alleyway we're going to come right through here uh, right up this side and it's going to connect right here to that fence and then that gate that's at the end is actually going to open into that alleyway and then later on we're going to have uh, we're going to continue and we're going to have a little uh, on this side over here uh, there'll be a room and that's what's going to we're going to stage you know we'll be able to kind of stage them in there catch them in that area and then kind of sort through what I need and then bring them through this alley so uh, stick with us here today and uh, we're going to go ahead and get started on this project
all right guys so i didn't record the entire thing here for you but uh this is what we've come up with here for right now um so i just took uh just took cattle panel and um i like the height of cattle panel the hog panels are too short i've had pigs jump over it so we don't use it um so i just uh just took the panels and went all the way down and and basically just went ahead and created this alley um you know that goes all the way down that way we can bring those pigs in and then uh the last thing on the agenda for that is we're going to go ahead and we're going to we're going to mount up this gate here and uh and it's going to sit kind of just like it is and that way we can close it off from here to there uh we'll close it against the building so that these pigs in this lot here um can't get to it and then when we need to use it we'll just open it up and then uh we'll have a temporary gate that'll go here and then we'll be able to push everything in so pigs pretty much left me alone they're out uh laying in their mud holes and trying to stay cool and uh all that good stuff so here's these guys and they've kind of they kind of done the same thing they're just hanging out chilling out here so we're uh we're gonna load up some cattle here we gotta get some cows in we gotta get some cows in here to the butcher and uh so we're gonna go ahead and get that done this afternoon get everything loaded up and we'll uh we'll bring you along all right so we're going to load up some cows here to take out the slaughter and uh we're going to uh, bring you here with us show you the process we're going to feed them up in here in a corral get them to come in lock them up sort them out and then uh load up too sounds easier than i think it's going to go Alright, that didn't get too bad. We're going to uh, back this truck up in here and then uh, get everything ready and push them up into the, uh, into the gate here. Change my shirt here, get a dry shirt on, change the hat for the ride. We don't have AC here in this truck, so we uh, roll the windows down and make the best out of it here. Um, but either way, guys, thanks for uh, coming along here with us on this episode. And uh, we've got uh, we've got a bunch of stuff kind of coming up. Um, the, that whole loading out of that area, uh, we've got an area there that, that's actually built with a load chute and alley and all kinds of stuff. Um, we're just trying to figure out uh, a way to kind of load out of one area and, um, and and actually feed out of one area too. And uh, I think we've got uh, some, some ideas kind of set up um, with maybe building a different alleyway and things like that with fence lines and stuff. So we've got that coming up. Um, a, lot of, a lot of work on the books here for this year in 2021 here at the farm. Uh, between getting the Farrow and barn up and going, uh, we still got to get electric to that barn. Um, we've got uh, we've got the, the the show barn here uh, finishing this this deal up, and then um, you know getting all of our stuff done for the pigs on the other side. We still got to build that one. Uh, we still got to build that one pin uh, for our boars, and then the one se uh, section pin there that we're going to be able to divide off and and run down those alleys and stuff. So. Uh, a bunch more work. It's uh, about mid-July. Um, we're trying to make the best of, out of the time that we can. Uh, as far as good weather, even though it's hot right now, uh, we've got some good weather here. So, guys, if you haven't already, uh, subscribe to the channel. Uh, like us on Facebook. Find us on Instagram. And uh, we'll see you again.